son. Come here. My dear child. What is it, Mom? Talk to me. Whatever it is, I'll make sure to take care of you. Would you like to see the world's quickest death flag? <laughs> Mommy, no! Ты мне очень нравишься. Я правда, правда люблю тебя. Bro, what? Why aren't you going for her? Я бы хотел купить дом с озером и завести 12 детей. It's as clear as day. She's into you. Yeah, I pass. День нашей свадьбы станет самым счастливым моментом в нашей жизни. You are making every guy in existence your worst enemy. I can't speak Russian, but I can read subtitles on the bottom of the screen. She's literally throwing herself at you. So, uh, I'm not interested. She's a 10 out of 10! She's a 10 out of 10, but she's also a sleeper agent. The fuck do you mean by a sleeper agent? Мало ли они знали, что мы уже проникли на следующие выборы в США. Однажды Киев падет. Слава Владимиру Путину. Слава Матушке России. Still think she's a 10 out of 10, bro? Uh, bro? Hello, this is Interpol. How may I help you? Hello, dear traveler. I know you're confused right now, and this may come as a surprise. It really isn't at this point. But you have been transported to another world filled with magic and sorcery, and you have been chosen and designated as a lord and savior in every sense of the word a hero <laughs> are you okay sir hero i got one question <coughs> for you you got some crack huh meth pardon heron you mean heron at least you got some weed right you stink when is the last time you took a shower i i don't know <sighs> please answer this honestly where were you originally from? San Francisco. Are you serious? This has to be some sort of prank. Out of all the previous isekai summons I did before, there's no way a junkie is supposed to be this era's hero. No. Calm down. Uh, bring it. This is merely a trial from God. Forgive me for my outburst, my lord. As a summoner, it is my job to help raise up and care for the hero to fulfill their duty. All I have to do is help him. Ugh. First things first, let's go ahead and... He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> the hero OD'd. The hero actually OD'd. <laughs> oh, God has forsaken us. Um, excuse me, can I ask you a question? Uh, sure, what is it? Can you please be my Discord kitten? Um, sorry to break it to you, but I'm a guy. <laughs> oh, that's even better. Hey! What do you think you're doing hitting on my twink? Well, too bad! Now he's mine! Since when? Since now! Well, well, have you ever got him to meow during a video game? Well, I have. I even have it recorded on my phone. Meow. You bitch. Bro, you're playing support and you refuse to heal me unless I did. Come here, look at this. Uh, look at what exactly? A dirty spoon for the sink is not wet after it made you all hot cocoa. Wait, how the fuck did he do that? I don't know, nor do I care. We must solve this. Huh? Well, the first thing that comes to mind is using the microwave. Are you seriously going to dedicate half this episode on figuring out how this dude made hot cocoa? Assuming that he used cocoa powder instead of regular chocolate, that makes sense. But there's one thing that doesn't make sense. When he gave us hot cocoa, they were all the same temperature. But if you use a microwave, you would have to heat them up one by one. So how do you heat them all up at the same time? 
Why do you care about this? You only drink hot cocoa out of your cup. So how do you even know that they were the same temperature? What if he heated up the milk itself? You're a genius! Objection! Who asked? Man, you must have been working on a cosplay costume all night. Yeah, it took up all my time, energy, and effort. But it's a bare minimum if you want to cosplay properly. Like, imagine trying to cosplay with shitty clothes. I couldn't. I had to learn how to make clothes myself. And you know what? It was easier than I thought. It just took a lot of trial and error. So you're saying making clothes is piss easy. A baby could do it with missing limbs. If you can't make your own cosplay clothes, you must really suck. It can't be an expression of love if you don't at least do this. It's a bare minimum. <laughs> All of your etchy scenes are getting censored. <laughs> I know, Kill the Justice League was a shit game. And we need something to fix our reputation. But you're telling me this is how we fix our reputation? Listen, man, I know a bunch of people like anime or whatever it's called. But they already started to cut corners. I mean, we're already on the second episode and they put a potato bag over Peacemaker's face so they don't have to animate it. <laughs> I don't know about you, but this is the perfect way to fix our reputation. No, it isn't. I don't know where we are, what language is speaking, or what's happening. I want to go home. Why go home when we are... Never mind. You uncultured swine would never understand. If you know what's going on, then tell us. Why should I? Oops. What? What the? Is... Is that a fucking child? That is my waifu, and to be clear, she is 3,000 years old. If they look like a child, and act like a child, then they are a child. Who cares about what you think? Being in an isekai, if it means I can meet my dream lolly, then so be it. <laughs> and I won't let any of you stop me. Oh god, he's a weeb gone off the deep end. Police! Oh no, what the? Let me, let me go. I just wanted cupcakes, but let me go. Wait, wait for me, my waifu. I will come for you someday. On last week's episode of My 600 Pound Life, Alfuda finally decided it was time for her to go to a gym and get professional help. With Naomi's assistance, she slowly started to trim off her belly fat. Although it was a struggle, she managed to lose all her weight. Thus, Alfuda was finally able to turn home to his inner world. In today's episode, she relapsed. You fat bitch! Today the past few months mean nothing! I'm not fat as cold of being big boned! That's it! I'm the best at this game! <laughs> Eat that! Look at all these fucking kids playing this game. Go back to school! Uninstall! Oh, look at that cockroach over there. I'm gonna go ahead and force a fight at the bridge. What? The ash got lucky. Are you kidding me? You stupid fucking. During yesterday's live stream, I said something completely inappropriate and unprofessional. It was not an accurate representation of me or my character. Short and simple, it was a bad joke. I apologize, and I won't do it again. Nah, we don't care. Huh? Nick Muck said the F store on stream and he still isn't cancelled. BITCH THE FUCK! Day 7684 of having no pussy. I'm getting desperate. Delusional. My intrusive thoughts are slowly gaining more and more power. I fear for the safety of those around me. Master, are you feeling unwell? Lately, my robot maid has been looking kind of... No. I shouldn't finish that statement. I mean, she's a robot, for crying out loud. Am I really going to stick my dick in a robot? Sexual hormones detected. Seduction protocol activated. Whoa, 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 whoa. We are not having sex. Pen up frustration detected. On a scale of 1 to 10, how old would you like to be? Zero, because we are not having sex.
And why do you look disappointed after hearing that? Should I change my body shape and curves to be more provocative? <sighs> Listen, I am a degenerate and I'm horny. There are lines a man should never cross. And treating women as objects is one of the things that a real man should never do. Please remind me what my job is in order to serve you. Uh, you're my maid? Question, am I a real person or a robot with an artificial personality? The latter? And are robots concerned objects? I mean, therefore, I am an object. Accordingly, without logic, it is not an immoral action to use your hot, manly flesh pipe to clean my guts out. <sighs> if I'm doing this, I'm going to do it blackout drunk. Yes, 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 I am going to. I have been stuck on this bus for 10 days now. And I haven't even made it down to a third of a toast bar. I am Alinea, later Mikula. Stop saying that! Why is my magic walking? Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Stay away! He hasn't invested any stat points in anything. Offense, defense, stamina. His build is dog shit. Yet he's throwing the boss I've been struggling with for days. Oh, that? That's because... It's a skill issue. You fucking filthy casual. Ever since I watched 100 Girlfriends, I have dreamed of having my own harem. Mm, what if I told you I can help fulfill that fantasy? Really? Ah, we are to that 10. Can we all have multiple personality disorder? Eh, uh, that's all an upgrade from that Russian spy from earlier. Did someone speak Russian? First off, that's a guy's voice. Second off, nice job proving the stereotype. Ara ara. It can't be a stereotype if it's a thing that's true. Now what do you say? It can be your own personal ham, you, you idiot. I am very confused. Yet, I also have a bonus from this. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but I'm going to accept this as my reality and move on the best way I can. Fuck you! What did I, what did I do wrong? This personality is constantly on the elemental cycle. Parkour. 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 Huh? Huh? Man, I can't believe I got cancelled for doing that. But you know what? I'm not going down without a fight. If my idol taught me anything, I just need to go in an empty area and hopefully plum some dead bodies. Don't worry, I will eventually catch up to you, look. Ah, oh, fuck! Universal karma! I can smell you. Yeah, and I can hear you. And why are you... Actually, how are you setting it upside down? <sighs> Fresh tuna. My favorite. <laughs> hey, fuck you. Tell me, do you like Yuri bait? I mean, it could be cool and all, but as long as that is a bait, if I tend to milk you dry. Why does it feel like my chastity is in danger? Your nose is bleeding. Hi, <laughs> you pup. You feel the same way as me. Uh, no, I just hit my nose on something earlier and actually- Ah, I can't take it! Let me give you a heck and suck on them titties! That's way too quick of a development! So, I guess we're family now. Our parents are married, so I guess that makes us step-siblings. I hope you'll take care of me. Same here. I know things will be shaky at first, given our age, but this is just the beginning. Here's to a long and lasting relationship that transcends blood between people we start off as strangers into family. Hey, where do your clothes at? What are you doing? Uh, keeping it in the family? 
Listen, I know we're not family by blood, but this is still wrong in so many ways. Besides, we literally just met. Look at the bottom left corner. What is in the bottom left corner? Oh. Oh. It was bound by fate to end up like this. You might as well just get to the point. Ugh, fuck it. Hi, I'm it. What are you doing, step bro? Attention all childhood friends that are girls. This is a PSA for your own mental health and sanity. There has been a rising case of girls, a similar archetype, being cock blocked and NTR'd, losing to the main female lead. This needs to stop. If you look over here, you can see a childhood friend in the wild. This one is called Anna Yanami, who just lost a long time crush to the main heroine. She's so desperate, she's starting to suck on his abandoned drink to fulfill her sick fantasies. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? To stop this pandemic, I must tell the truth. And the truth is harsh. And blunt. Grow a fucking spine. What is happening in this way? I was this guy to confess. I mean, come on. Look at this hot mess. Girls don't come with balls being stalled. But if they did, she'd be having a hot makeout session with a lover by now. Instead, she's going to cry herself to sleep and purely dry hump her pillows. He said he was going to marry me. He even put a flower ring on my finger. Frankly, she had blue hair, so this was a lost cause to begin with. So scary! <laughs> Don't be like Anna. Don't wait for the man to confess anymore. It's 2024 for crying out loud. If you have a crush, go confess. The worst they can say is no. <laughs> and that is it. Man, this... One took a long time to make, but I think it was pretty worth it in the end. I think it came out good. If you liked what you saw, you can like, comment, subscribe, you know, do all that good shit. If for some reason you want to hear more of my cringy ass voice and voice acting, you can check out the other and previous anime abridges for previous seasons, or watch some of my other anime or manga videos, or check out my variety content. I do a lot of stuff on this channel, but if there's anything that catches your interest, check it out. What, what bother just to click on the video, you know? Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, I don't know what you are talking about. There is no other anime that's airing this season that I want to talk about. Wait. Why is, why is there Don and Don episodes and Ranma and Arcane? Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Oh dear God!